Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast review and today we're going to take a look at Race Team Mater. So before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So when Lightning McQueen took on a new paint job from Ramon, Mater along with Luigi and Guido Fillmore and Sarge took on a Team Number 95 logo on each of their doors. And together the the sick the six sum traveled to Tokyo for the first race of the World Grand Prix against a new racing rival, Francesco Bernoulli, who turns out not to be a bad guy in the end. They, they cruised along the streets of Tokyo and watched a group of Japanese fan dancers and watched sumo wrestling and they even came to the welcoming party when Lightning tells Mater to act different than, than in Radiator Springs and Mater and Mater saw the Zen Master Pity raking some rocks in a isolated garden didn't? Didn't? I mean, I must admit, that scene was pretty funny. What do you guys think? Was that scene pretty funny to you? Let me know what you think in the comments down below. So anyway, Mater introduced Lightning to Francesco. And the two of them toasted to the future win of either Francesco or Lightning. And... And when Mater was getting some some all in all cans, he he, he saw wh what he thought was pistachio ice cream, as it turns out to be wasabi. So he tasted it, and then he screamed and found himself some water with a number ninety five on it. <laughs> and then Lightning introduced Sir Miles Axelrod to Mater, but which he didn't need to, need to, and Axelrod leaked oil and blamed it on Mater. And while Mater was in the bathroom taking care of himself, an American spy car named Rod Torque Redline and entered and was beaten up by Grim and Acer, and the three of them got into a fight, and the fight was ended. When Mater came out of the bathroom, you know, then he saw Grim and Acer and recognized their models and makes. And Rod, who was trying to recover, passed on a device to Mater. And, and, and then Mater met Holly Shiftwell, who, who she and Finn thought he was actually... Rod Torg Redline in disguise and stated that a Volkswagen Carmen Ghia has no radiator and made a reply that's because it's air cooled and then he went on about Volkswagens, Beetles, Carmen Ghias, Type 3 Squarebacks with a pancake motor and Type 2 buses like his friend Fillmore for example. And, and Holly suggested that they should rendezvous at the races. And then he met, then Mater met his friends up again and said, and told them that he was on a date, although Guido never believed him. Then during, then during the first race, Holly was trying to, and during the first, and during the first race of the World Grand Prix, 
Sarge Mater, Louis, Luigi Guido, and Fillmore were part of Lightning McQueen's pit crew for the uh, for the race. He's, and near, and almost at the end of the, and everything was running smoothly until Holly Shiftwell communicated with Mater to to leave the pits when Graham and Acer were were ganging up on him and were fended off by by Finn McMissile. And when Mater said stay outside, you know, light. Lightning was furious. Lightning was furious and moved out to the outside, causing Francesco to take the lead and win the race. And and back at the pits, lightning lightning he met up with Mater and and said that he didn't need his help and didn't want his help, forcing Mater to quit the team. And. That is it. So now let's get right into the review here. Here we've got his friendly facial expression, his buck teeth, his one headlight and his no headlight and no hood, just his engine. And on the left side we've got the shabby blue paint on the enamel and the his name in shabby green with a Team 95 emblem on each side of his doors and the gas cap and brown rims on on his front black wall tires and a yellow rim on one of his rear tires. And on the back we've got the tow hook and tow cable and his back bumper which has black and yellow hazard stripes and a license plate saying A113. And on the right side, we've got a chrome silver rim on another one of his rear tires. And we also got the side view mirrors. And that is it. So now let's compare them to the regular Mater. Both are shabby brown. Side view mirrors. And single headlight and two buck teeth and no hood just the engine the shabby blue paint and brown rims on front tires and yellow rim on one of the rear tires and gas cap and here are some differences team 95 on on door, no Team 95 on door. The tow cables and black and hazard stripes on the bumper and the A1 license plate saying A113. Chrome silver rims on another rear tires. And that is it. So now let's pull up some of the other Maters. We've got Mater with Balloon, Mater the Greater, and Rescue Squad Mater. And the rest of the Team 95 townsfolk, we've got Race Team Fillmore, Race Team Sarge, Lightning McQueen with racing wheels, or should I say WGP Lightning McQueen, or Cars 2 Lightning McQueen, Race Team Luigi, and Race Team Guido. And that is it. The entire Team 95 World Grand Prix team. So, what do you guys think? Which Mater is your favorite? And which Team 95 World Grand Prix member is your favorite also. Leave your thoughts in the comments down below, as well as leaving any suggestions in the comments as well. And if you have enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more. Please consider viewing and subscribing. It, I would really appreciate it very much. Oh, I also forgot to mention that Mater 
took on this decal in the as one of the playable the main playable characters in the Cars 2 video game, along with Lightning McQueen with racing wheels, Finn McMissile, Holly Shiftwell, and Francesco Bernoulli. And I hope to see you all guys next time for another review. Goodbye now!